trucking is the engine that keeps America moving. And with the tax cuts, we've been able to increase our capital investment this year by $127 million, 90% of which is dedicated to trucks and trailers that are cleaner, safer, and better for the American roadways. Mr. President, you care about truck drivers, and we see that. You know, we cover this country and haul freight that keeps America moving every day. Thank you so much for fighting for us. This tax law means a better future for me and a significant pay increase this year, which will allow me to take my family on a trip that we've been planning for years but never quite made it. With the reductions, I've been able to open my second restaurant, provide insurance and health benefits for my key managers in my company, and I've really seen a huge increase in our downtown Main Street economy boost. So thank you, Mr. Thank President. Thank you very much, Dan. Thank you very thank much. You. Appreciate it. In addition to seeing increases in their weekly uh, paychecks, we gave bonuses of $500 and $1,000 to all our employees. Deanne in our accounting department told me that she's using the extra money for what she describes as a dream bucket list vacation to visit her daughter, who was recently discharged from the Navy, who's now in Hawaii. I'm very proud to announce that we're getting along very well with respect to the whole uh, very big negotiation that we're having with China. For many years, our country has been uh, very much taken advantage of. I don't blame China. I blame our representatives, frankly. So China is uh, negotiating with us very hard, very long, and we've made a lot of progress for opening it up and for getting rid of those tariffs. And I think you're going to see some tremendous business openings. America was built by men and women like you who never give in, never give up, and never, ever stop believing in that great American dream.